Don't do well. How are y'all this evening? Doing, doing well. well. How Thank are you? you? Doing all right. Let's go. Absolutely. I'm trying to. You guys have a great day now. You as well. Go get water now. Yeah, that's good. Oh, how do you do? The chosen gunsmith on the slide. I, I think you still have my piece of garlic. Mm, yeah, I do. Here, here you go. Oh, thank you. How do? How are you doing today? How are you doing today? Hello, doing fine. How are you? I'm doing fantastic and enjoying the nice, beautiful weather today. Doing some business, you know. Oh, that's good. Yeah, at least it's not raining today. It's a nice yeah. liquid sunshine. Yeah, that's right. The past, I think it's like uh, two days ago, it's like a water huge away. storm yeah, going around. It's not working for me. Oops, there we go. Uh, change of weather, uh, you know, out of nowhere. Okay, it just like I don't oh, like shit. this stuff. I think it's all this electricity we have in this town so. that's starting to affect things. Mm, you think so? Yeah. Well, it has to. It's charged up with all of those charged particles, and they say oh, the atmosphere God. and lightning is charged particles, and here's all these wires releasing all those mm. particles into the air. Oh my God, so much science. <sighs> it's a lot. But it I don't know, it has to be related to the to yeah. the electricity. We just got a lot of electricity. Now we're having the weird storms and stuff. Yeah, that's kinda weird. That the nothing see that about I kinda there's a lot of lightning too coming, you know, about yeah. the city. It's and those it's those electric lights. They're drawing <clears throat> that lightning down. Oh I know they are. Oh, we 
Gotta do something about all these wires everywhere. Um, you know, the electric company's right over there. Maybe we should know. sneak in and destroy their equipment. Yeah, there's a lot over there, and there's so many lights over there now. And look how tall those towers are. Oh, you see that smoke? Oh yeah. my god, disgusting. All those towers putting out that smoky vapor, it's got to do something oh, to maybe, the clouds. You think, you think that's affecting the clouds? It's it's making clouds. Oh. Look at that manufacturing oh. storm clouds. You know how the storm clouds are dark and gray like that? Oh, they're not makes the, sense now. Yeah, they're not the white clouds. that They're making storm clouds. Mm, this evil man yeah. controlling the weather. It is? <sighs> How, what do you think? How, how should we stop them from... I don't know. It starts with this electrical stuff. We gotta get rid of all this stuff. We gotta start spreading the word somehow. No more electricals. We gotta get rid of that stuff. To go back up to all, all trusty fire. Yeah, well, you know, we had all the oil lanterns and stuff. That was working fine. All this new modern stuff. Everybody thinks it's nice, but they're gonna think twice once that. Yeah, that, that. Look right. my trusty oil exactly. lanterns. Exactly. Like and also, you have to have. You have to have cotton balls to put in your ears because the buzz that goes on with electric lights. That's right. Mm. Uh, people are going to start having to roll They're going fabric. Crazy. They're going to have to stuff it in their ears. Especially when you go to the stables, listen to those lights in that stable. Oh, they're gosh. just humming and buzzing all the time. I think they're on all the time. They don't even turn them off during the day. You think that's what makes people crazy when they go to the stable? Maybe, you know that stable boy always crazy, killing spills yeah. evil stuff out all the people and stuff like that. Oh, yeah. he's taking out his frustrations on everyone because mm. he's standing there listening to that buzzing all day long. You've got I'll, it. I will go crazy. You figured it out. That's exactly what it is. It's always reminding you you're off the farm. And <laughs> Mama know you left the farm. farm. This town ain't big. This time, this town ain't big for the two of us. Yeah, that's right. Mm. It's not big enough for all these cloud makers we got around here. Mm. Must start spreading the word. Yeah. Stop this evil man from creating this evil clouds. Uh. We do our best here in town. I'm trying to tell other people. We were in Blackwater just the other day, and it was raining really badly. And you know when the water hits those lines up there, it charges up with all that electricity, and then the water drip drips down on people. Oh, it's yeah. got to do something to them. And look at those lines up there right now, wriggling <laughs> and writhing like snakes. Oh, my God. It's like they're alive. No, you, you don't like snakes, I know. You ever heard the phrase alive with electricity? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's... That's what look, they're doing right now. They are, they're alive. We gotta do moving. something. Mm. One of these days, every, well, you, you guys are gonna wake up and you're gonna see all this, this post right here in front of me uh -huh. on the floor. I'm gonna oh, cut them down. Oh, that'll be good. One I'm... by one. I know, I'm ready. I told Eustace we should start taking down the electric lights, just one by one. Secretly at night, remove another electric light. No one's going to miss them. Mm -hmm. And once we get them all removed, they'll just replace them with, with what used to work. Fire. Yeah. Nice gas lantern, never hurt hey, anyone. Hey, let's go. Of course, of oh. course. Oh, I think that's my cute <laughs> All right, we'll see you, you guys stay around. Safe. I'll, I'll you make well. sure to spread the word. All right. Yeah. Uh, have a good we'll, evening. We'll, we'll, we'll put a stop to this. All right, guys. You guys stay safe. All right. You as well. Yeah. Right, you got good you guys, all right. One other time, Eustace, we're informing people. Yeah, just one at a time. We just gotta keep everybody informed. It's happening. People are getting there. Most people are on. Most people are on the same path we're on with this electrical stuff. <sighs> you ready to go to the Orange Grove, or did you need to drop something off in storage? Mm, I don't need to drop anything. We can go get oranges if we're ready. Okay. 
Still winning. Not anymore. I'm putting it in fast shoe here. Uh oh, they're all pointing at something. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> Look at the arch she's got. Jesus. Uh -huh. I'm trying to figure out what you're pointing at. Oh my god. My pussy. Oh. Well, that's alright. I've met you before, right, miss? I believe so. My name's Elviny. Oh, nice to meet you again. Well, nice to see you again, I should say. Oh, that's nice to see you as well. My name Friend. is Eustace. This, Eustace. Is my, this is my husband, Eustace, yes. Husband? Oh, yeah, we've yes. been married over 60 years. Oh, 60 years. He looks like 20, he looks oh. 21. Holy shit. Oh, get up that's look at this. <laughs> too <laughs> sweet of you. We look oh, at you. Hallelujah. We look hallelujah. at you close, Eustace, huh? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that could not have yeah he doesn't look that old. He looks about, I would say, you know. Don't the cakes look ethereal? I mean, he could just be, he looks like he could just be a really, like, aged 20 year old, you know? Just polishing the cake. Mm, but I have gray hair. <laughs> well, you know, there's a, there's a 20 year old right here who has gray hair. Ah. 27. Well. I'm almost 30. That extra seven years, oof. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're, you're more closer to 27 than you are 30. You want to see Are, something that interesting? That Bobby's arch, though, Jesus Christ. Oh, oh. look at that. There's a slight wiggle there, too. Yeah, that's why I've been married, you know? I've been married for two months. It's all about the wiggle. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, Bobby, I have my entire face. Wiggle, wiggle, there. wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Oh! You want to see something interesting? I don't know if you've yeah. ever seen it before. I, I have to turn and face the light. I have to figure out which way the sun is coming from. Here we go. Okay. All right. Now, if you take a look closely at my monocle, you're going to have to look through your eyes really close at it. You see something unusual there. Not everyone has seen this. Right there near the little handle, you have to look on the glass. Wait, what? What? Yeah. What is that? It's a little crescent moon. Oh my god, that is so cute. I know, you didn't even know it was there, did you? Uh-huh, it's so cute. Well, thank you very much. It's it's a pair of Eustace's old glasses. Eustace, Aww. Eustace fell and broke them, and I just, I took one half of them, and I made it into what looks like a monocle. Nobody knows the difference. Yeah, I don't blame you. Yeah. Uh oh You know what, Eustace, you're like a nice version of that old witch that I know. Oh, is there a witch? Oh, no. Who? I'm not, I'm not even going to say her name, because she might fall from the sky. Oh. At, on one of those, on one of those unicycles, come down from the sky on the unicycle. I can picture that. Don't, yeah. don't you just love this, Jim? <laughs> just like old times. What do you do, what do, you do yeah, in the city? Sure it's like it's still... Just a little of this and that. Yeah. Eustace does some hunting, and we, we try to manufacture some leathers, but it's been hard to sell them. Oh, yeah, yeah. Not okay. many people are interested in leather right now. The coffee shop boys, uh, I think, will, will always buy leather. Oh, The right. coffee shop? What was, uh, oh, the, probably the flask. That's probably what they're using it for. Are they putting coffee in flasks now? That's interesting. Uh, it's mm -hmm. better if they put whiskey in the flask. 
You could yeah. warm. You could warm your pocket if you went to the cold up north. If you mm -hmm. have a hot coffee and a flask. Mm-hmm. Like a little, like a little water bottle. Yeah, and I think the gun shop uh, is always buying leather too. Ooh. All right. Well, we'll have to try those. We we mm. haven't tried the coffee shop. Mm, I did try the gun shop. Uh, I got two raffle tickets for the upcoming raffle. <laughs> I can force those on you too. They did me. They did it to me too. Yeah, I traded leather for the raffle tickets, so. Oh, that's a good. Yeah, that's a good trade off. Uh, because I don't have money. Uh, it's no use in yeah. carrying it if you're just going to get robbed. Yeah, I know. I know. How, how do you feel about this electricity here in town? It's it's starting to go around everywhere. I know. Well, I was when I when I was born, uh, electric. We just started to have like uh, fire lamps in the house yeah. that were made that were powered by electricity, oh, and that was kind of, you know, it felt like we lived in the future. I know. I feel like with this electrical stuff, it's it's gonna pass. It's, people aren't gonna want this stuff up in the future. Yeah. I mean, I like to do things by candlelight, you know. That's right. That's I like much to, better. I like to have date nights with my husband by candlelight. We've been having a lot more of these storms lately. And mm -hmm. if you look, those large smokestacks, look at that, coming out of those smokestacks. Uh, it's it's not yeah. white like the like the clouds. Yeah, that, well. It's dark like the storm clouds. It's got that gray yeah. tint to it. Do you think that's what's causing the storms? It is. I'm pretty sure. It's more and more of that stormy cloud. It's like the factory is producing Bobby storm clouds. <gasps> yeah. Ah, all at the expense of having just a little bit more light. Mm -hmm. I'm fine with the way things were, this modern I stuff. I mean, You're going to have to take that cotton and stuck it, stuff it in your ears just to get rid of the buzz of the electric light. Have you heard mm -hmm. all that buzzing inside the stables? That stable boy, he's always got a smart attitude. I he think does. I hate him. It's that buzzing that's always going in there. I think it's slowly driving him insane in there. Well, yeah. Just have uh, a, he, it's a horrible attitude. The future is going to be filled with stuffed ears. People aren't going to be able to tolerate all the buzzing they hear all the time. Hmm. I think, well, hopefully the, this electricity thing will pass, you know? I'm pretty sure. I think people are just going to figure out it's more dangerous than it's worth. What do you think will happen to these lights and that, that pylon over there? Oh, no, not that. Look, it's got so many, like, wires coming off it. Look at that. Oh, that's so dangerous. We were mm -hmm. in Blackwater just the other day and it started raining. And they didn't believe me, but all that water touches that electrical line and then mm. what's it do it drips down on people after it's all charged up with electricity oh yeah yeah this has got to be causing trouble around town I wonder, you know, I wonder if that's why there's so many yeah i wonder if that's why there's so many crazy people in town you know it could be mm. what's that Eustace? Uh, I just said that uh, somebody's going to get electrocuted by the electrical wire. The wires are getting wet. Yeah. It's just a matter of time. And then we have all of this electricity run for one of those streetcars. And what did they do with the streetcar after they ran all the electricity? Where's it at now? I donh, don't know. That's right. You, should, you know what? You should say uh, when Miss Ermagine has a town hall, you should come. And, and and pose all these questions. Oh, that's right. Oh, we oh. did go to the last one. It seemed like a, a pissing match near the end. Uh, uh, no, it always devolves into that eventually. It yeah. was doctors versus doctors. Some doctors oh, wanted God. change. Some doctors didn't want change. Oh, but Lord. they were airing it out in a public forum. Just decide. Make a choice. Yeah. Yeah, you should definitely take these questions to Armageen because all right. I think I feel like they're legitimate concerns, you know? I do too, especially with all the storms and stuff we're having. People are nervous about it now. And yeah. those factories are producing storm clouds, I know they are. I know. I know. Okay, well, I'm going to go find my friends. Right. You two be yeah, safe. Sure. And we're heading out to the Orange Grove. Watch out for the rain. To the Orange Grove? 
Yeah, hopefully it's uh, quieter today, not uh, filled with robbers. Yeah. Oh. Be safe. Mm, you too. You as well. All right, you're still soft. 